Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I had a break making and creating and posting some videos on YouTube just because I have an injury. Finally, my fingers um, can move and I don't feel any pain in my wrist. And at the beginning, I was thinking to start posting videos back again when they'll remove my cast, but it's gonna be at the end of May. So what I've decided just to take this challenge and try to create some recipes that are really filling, really yummy, but you can do it with your limited mobility and very simple recipes. What we're gonna do today, we're gonna cook a green lentil soup, they already pre-washed, and we'll bake all of these vegetables, pepper, garlic, onion, and a carrot. And then we'll blend all together with sun-dried tomatoes, salt, uh, paprika, and if you like spicy food, some crushed chili. At the end, when we'll cook our soup, um, we'll add this um, mixture to our soup. And I forgot to mention, we'll use also fresh um, dill. You know, combination of baked, slightly smoky vegetables and fresh greens are really good in soups. Let's just start. We'll just add salt to our veggies. So that they can produce some juice when we bake them. Then paprika. I don't really measure usually paprika, I just like put it so that it can cover uh, my veggies with paprika. And again the next step is chili pepper. So again you can skip it so that if you don't like spicy food, but I do. And we'll use instead the oil that we have here in sun dried tomatoes so that we don't have to trash it first of all, second of all, so that our soup not too oily because we'll, if we'll add some extra oil while um, baking our veggies, our soup can be just too oily, too much um, oil in our soup. So now we'll put it into the oven for 30 minutes at 450 degrees Fahrenheit. First we'll crush dill and sun-dried tomatoes so that we need to make sure that it's really blended well into because sometimes I've noticed sun-dried tomatoes if I mix them with vegetables right away they're not crushed completely leaving big pieces of tomatoes Veggies are ready, so we'll just wait for them to cool down a bit and I just love just to see the veggies baked and slightly smoking, just lovely. We'll add all the vegetables into our food processor. Another tricky part just to squeeze garlic out from oopsie didn't really work so I'll have to peel maybe every single piece separately. It's okay. And now we'll just simply combine our cooked lentils and our baked and blended vegetables. I will simply bring it to boil. So now soup is ready and you can enjoy it with bread, naan or rice. What is good about this soup? It is freezer friendly so that you can cook like a whole pot, divide it and put into containers, freeze it and you can enjoy it 
for a whole week and it doesn't really lose taste. So I hope you'll cook this soup and enjoy it. Thank you for watching my video.